Hello, sixth grade. Today's homework is about interpreting coordinates. So what we're really saying is, what do each of these dots on the graphs mean? I'm going to start with the bottom problem. It says, Baker Elon graphs the relationship between the number of candles and the number of pieces each cake has been cut into. So if I look down on the bottom of my graph, I can see a bunch of numbers, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 10, 11. That's the candles. And then if I look at the up and down part, I see 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, and that is the pieces of cake. All right, so now I'm going to look at the rest of it. It says the coordinates of point A. Let me highlight this. The coordinates of point A are 7, 14. So if I look at point A and I go straight down, you can see that I get to 7. And if I go straight across, I get to 14. So the question is 7 what? That's 7 candles and the 14 refers to 14 pieces of cake. So what do the 7 and 14 refer to? The 7, oh, there are 7 candles and 14 pieces of cake, right? And when we really say pieces of cake, maybe I should change that around a little bit. And the cake has been cut into... 14 pieces. All right. So your job now is to do point Z. So now you're going to look at Z, the coordinates of point Z. You need to put it into the parentheses and tell me how many pieces and how many candles. All right. I wish you the best of luck. Don't forget to turn this in and do the first problem about Tyler's pets. All right, see you in class tomorrow.